can they get a qualifier this early in the season? Uh, well, that will be, uh, we'll have to wait and see there. World Champs qualifying standard 13.23, so they're going to have to be pretty hot on the pace tonight. Maybe still a little bit windy for fast, fast running like that, but it's certainly it's cool enough for these distance runners. Yeah, no. And uh, I'll send it up to you, Mossy. You can tell us, talk us through the field here. Yeah, mates. Uh, just if we see there, as on the screen, Dua Yoa, Mitch Brown from Victoria, Brett Robinson, Zatapec 10 winner, Dave McNeil. Brenton Rowe, Benny St. Lawrence spoke to him today. He's just hoping to get through this race without pulling up too lame with his uh, Achilles that's been plaguing him over the last couple of years. Uh, most of these guys have been up at Falls Creek, so like so many of the distance runners do at this time of year, each year get a bit of altitude training. And so we're away now in our final event of the evening, the 5,000 metres. We'll have a couple of pacemakers here, and no doubt some of the athletes there uh, will, will have told those pacemakers the exact pace they want. So, looks like Nipris has got himself a good position early. Also, Michael Marantelli there, the AFL boundary rider. See him a lot on the Victorian Athletics League. So, Marantelli goes straight to the lead. Benny Saint tucked in at fourth there. As we see them come through, that's one kilometre done. Four to go, so a 2.52. Mitch Brown's made a big move here, heading to the lead. So we've got Brown, Rowe, Robinson and Nipper. And then there's Benny Sain. And Benny Sain's having a good little run there as well. Following, so a bit of a tactic starting to come here. Dave McNeil wants to go with him as well. And Benny Sain. It's really starting to get exciting here as we've got six laps to go here. The clock's ticking over. 8.25, 8.26, 8.27, 8.28. 8.28. Yeah, mate. The down the back straight. Robinson running well. Sitting with him is Nipris. He won't go away. And McNeil is right with him as well. And I'm, I'm quite impressed there with young Rayner. Who are you liking from here, Robbo? Look, uh, it's hard to go past Robbo. <laughs> he's looking good. I think, uh, look, he's going to have to go out on his own here. But, um, yeah, McNeil's, you know, hanging in. I can see what's the gap there. That's five, ten metres. But uh, the wheels are starting to fall off a little bit for Nipper. Uh, Benny Saint comes around. He's uh, he's actually looking pretty good. We can never ben, write Benny Saint no, off his can't. class. McNeil's trying to go with him, but Robinson just looks super impressive out in front on his own. So uh, Robinson, we know how much of a class athlete he is. Represented Australia, uh, and he really has put the foot down. Um, Benny Saint Lawrence still looks good there. Rainer's running very well there in third spot, and Dua Yoa striding away well there. But down the back straight there, Brett Robinson is running very well, and. Uh, you know, with about 650 metres to go, I'll be putting my money on him because he's looking very good. But McNeil won't give up. He's coming up to 500 metres to go. He'll take the bell here and he'll see what he's got left in the tank to kick home. But here we go. Brett Robinson takes the bell. Brett Robinson here, the camera boy, with about 350 metres to go. Can McNeil get to him? McNeil's looking good. I'm not going to write him off yet. Benny Saints into third space there, and Rainer's in fourth. Brett Robinson running very well. Here comes McNeil. To go, but McNeil's not done. He's not done. I told you so. McNeil's looking to get onto him, and Robinson looks over his shoulder. 200 to go now. Can McNeil get there? If he did, it would be emphatic. But McNeil's not giving up. Robinson's in the lead. He's got a bit up his sleeve, and I think he's going to have enough on him. He yeah, hits the home straight now. Bring him home, Molly. I think Robbo's got it. He's here comes Robbo. Here. The man from the ACT, Brett Robinson, a class athlete. What a class run that is. He's not going to get a qualifier today, but he gets the win. And a great run there from Dave McNeil. I thought with about 400 to go, he was a sniff. But Brett Robinson there, all class, 13.43, 15. A great run there. McNeil takes second. Benny St. Lawrence in third there. Rayner takes fourth. Clark in fifth, sorry, Mitch Brown there in fifth. Brenton Rowe runs well there for six, and Dua Yoa coming home there, and Nipris, he ran very well early on. So what an absolutely outstanding performance here in the men's 5,000 metres. Great run out there in front by Brett Robinson, the Canberra Cannon, they call him. And uh, he'll be very happy with that win there, and no doubt he's heading in the right direction, as the, a lot of our fans here have been... I guess swamped here with rain, and um, they've had a great night of athletics. How good was that, Robbo? Yeah, look, absolutely sensational run there by Brett Robbo Robinson.